Um, well, I think <clears throat> from a uh, lessons learned standpoint, we could probably spend the entire hour talking about that. Um, I'll probably add to some of the comments that Dr. Cullen made. Um, you know, one of the things that, that fascinates me as we implement these technologies is sort of the human factor impact. And, and what I've come to realize, particularly now that uh, we've been in the DOD, that um, uh, many times a, a health IT initiative ends up being a, a fairly disruptive influence, and it and it disrupts the way people work. It it, it disrupts relationships that have been built up over time, cultural factors that have been in place sure. uh, for for a long time, and so um, yeah, as Dr. Cullen said, requirements are really important. Um, but but I think the the other lessons that uh, we want to be sensitive to is how how does the implementation of this technology change the way people work and and what kind of uh, disruptions uh, could those changes cause, and how do we deal with those disruptions? How do you how do you train physicians? I mean, we we're just in a meeting yesterday about telehealth and 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 teleradiology. Telehealth is an area where the where the VA is really probably one of the national or international sure. leaders. Okay. We're trying to adopt some of their methodologies, but you know, you're you're asking physicians to change the way they work, um, and you know. Sometimes you get resistance, and yeah, how do you oh, how do you that. how do you uh, promote yeah. that? So uh, <laughs> these these are all factors that are not technology directly. I, I was at a conference, uh, spoke at a conference uh, last week, and and told people that my job is more about anthropology than uh, than technology. <laughs> yeah. You know, because yeah. it's really change management and and changing some of these work practices and things like that. So lessons learned uh, certainly is to pay attention to. Uh, some of the procedural and cultural um, factors that may be impacted as you roll out this yeah, new technology. Excellent. Ex excellent, excellent points. I know every time I go to my doctor, he brings in the, la the little computer there and he complains about, I can't now have to figure this, figure this, you know, this thing's driving me crazy kind of thing. But over time, he realizes that uh, this is going to make a big, big difference. But as a patient, <coughs> though, you, you want that eye contact. Sure. I read a very interesting article about that. You know, you don't want your doctor heads down over his laptop while he's talking That's to right. you and, and looking at his laptop. That's he wants you point. to be, you want him to be talking to you and looking at you. Absolutely. So, you know, that's a cultural change. How do you deal with that? Yeah.